What's up, what's up, what's up? It's Lonnie Latte with the Hip Hop 3D News. Blueface's mother is threatening legal action if she cannot see her grandchildren. Hip Hop DX reports that Blueface and his mother have had a rocky relationship. On Monday, Carlisa Saffold took to Instagram to make it clear that she is not backing down. So will she will do whatever it takes to see her grandchildren, even if her son Blueface does not comply, she said, it, I didn't bend over backwards and raise my MFing kids to be denied my bloodline. You go tell them MFers that mama coming. In September, she also said she wanted her son to have another child and she had some potential future baby mamas in mind, one being Megan the Stallion. So I don't know, would you tell your son what he can do with his kids? Like, did they have to see you? You know, or, you know, I, I could understand wanting to see your, your grandchildren. I understand that, uh, taking them to court, uh, not as much. I don't, I don't think, I don't know, but you know, good luck to them, whatever they're doing. Hopefully they get a better relationship, but you can't tell them to who to date. You know, you could say, I like this person. I like this person, but you know, you gotta let people date who they're going to date, or they're going to turn around and just try to be rebellious and not date the person you know, if you just telling them what to do all the time or whatever, I'm not saying that's what she's doing, but you know, uh, you have to back off a little bit as they get older and let them make their own decisions a little bit. But I see where she's coming from by wanting to see her grandchildren, see her son happy with the right person, whether that's the person he's with or a new person or whatever, but you have to let him make his own decisions. You know, as a mom, that's kind of like when they get older, the hardest thing about being a parent is letting your kid get out on their own and make their own decisions. It's a little hard, but good luck to them. Hopefully they have a better relationship. Just be there if he needs anything, I would say, and, you know, do what you can to be good to him and the grandchildren when the opportunities do arrive, arise, good luck. If you do go to court or whatever, that it works out for both of them, hopefully. So in other news, Rick Ross is celebrating the release of his new album to too good to be true, which will be officially dropping on November 10th. Meanwhile, he has his own sweepstakes going. The Too Good To Be True sweepstakes will be giving a lucky fan the chance to win $50,000. No purchase necessary. The sweepstakes will end November 16th at 11.59 p.m. Pacific. Go to www.toogoodtobetrue.com to enter for your chance to win. Some artists collaborating on his new album are DJ Khaled and Meek Mills with a single that is out right now called Shaq and Kobe. Rose has a line in this song that goes, how you dead broke, but you got a dope charge, got to rob a bank, just a post bond. I love that. That's dope. I love that right there. That's really cool. And that kind of reminds me of last week, you know, when D1 was saying that Rick Ross basically was kind of, you know, conflicting with himself saying that he was from prison. He was for prison reform. And then in other parts of his songs, basically he was saying, you know, you get murked at a stoplight and stuff like that, you know? So this is really showing that he is shedding some shade on putting some shade on the prison system and stuff like that. So yeah, I think that Ricky Rose hit home with this song, Shaq and Kobe. I think it's great. Meek Mills did a great job on the track and everything. So make sure you go get it. Make sure that you put your name in the hat for the Too Good To Be True sweepstakes. It's great. You know what I'm saying? So November 10th, the album drops. Make sure you go get it. Good luck to Blueface and his mama with the kids and everything. What would you do? Would you tell your son what to do and try to see your grandkids and take them to court and everything. What would you do? Would you tell them today? What would you do? Let me know in the comments, like, and share this video. Thank you for watching. This is Lonnie Latte with the hip hop 3d news.